artist way in fact which was a chapter on recovering the recovering a sense of power was the chapter that I did for an hour oh, 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 not quite actually and I've condensed it to under 45 minutes in fact but why I am coming to you now is because I haven't had a lot of energy to do so previously because I stirred the pot energetically. Debutante, it showed. <laughs> That's funny because on a debutante, it was the first time I was actually in court in attendance supporting a woman standing for herself as I'm doing in my trial and by going to support others who are also standing as we are instead of what we're made to be or made to pretend to be, I'm learning and growing. And so when I went to this hearing with this woman who was dealing with a settlement issue with her ex, I wouldn't stand for the woman acting as judge because she is not my honor and I misaddressed her by saying you're not my worship when I refused to stand and remained sitting when I was told it's court protocol you have to stand so I'm learning how that dynamic works specifically because obviously I didn't want to get her upset or in trouble in any way. I didn't want to get in trouble either specifically, however, I also am not interested in losing standing, which I don't have standing in a matter I'm not involved in, which is the thing for those that are bringing allegations of the COVID hoax, for instance, into a court of law using other people's cases for which the one bringing evidence in to these matters doesn't have standing unless they make claims and are able to actually exercise them or the man or woman that is allowing them in knows what they're doing. So it's very complicated and ultimately standing is a huge part of jurisdiction and la 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 i don't know i don't know but i do care and what i have to say is that i dare to stand as the woman i am and if i don't get to go back into the court because i'm told it's protocol and i'll not follow it I'll sit outside and I'll wait for the one still inside to come out. Yes, it's true, and yet I would prefer to know how to advocate for myself and others too. Self-advocation is what the name of the new game is. Because if we don't know how to stand as we are, we'll be commanded to be other than actually are or see the world to be what do you have to say about this today leave a comment down below and let me know because what I will also say and why I show this now is because I stirred the pot emo Shanali, when I did something contrary to what we're told we're supposed to do, and when I did so, I lost a friend with the system that thought I would comply with nonsense and pretend to be other than I am. Well, I, I will not and say that we have fought to be ourselves. Oh yes, I have, and so now I will just keep troubling on this path, even though it's sparse with others who know how to walk as a man or oh, woman on the firm lands of common law, uncapitalized or hyphenated to 
because those have been written, which means they're limited. The common laws, unwritten and unlimited, that we can draw from as we feel necessary, and then we stand on our claims, file them, and take names of the men and women who act against you. Who's watching me, wondering whether you should try to stand as you are? Any misaddressing of you as your person, once you've clarified you are not that which you are implied to be, and that you'll not be surety. Those two things are big, and to say also that the common law argument is best paired with standing in your private capacity as a man or woman who doesn't agree to go public and when you're drawn into public courts know that they are limited
public and private, that's the mixed war. Look it up. On one side is public, on one side is private. The public are bound by contracts, and in the private, you can do whatever you please, so long as there's a shared agreement between the parties involved, which are not parties, they are people. Man and woman, or man on man, woman on woman, however it works. It is between living ones. Once it is wrote, well, then you cannot denote change because it is down and that's it. Except you can make amendments. Oh, it's just the peculiarities, the specifics. Who likes those? All the tickets that come with violating rules you never agreed to in the first place, but were applied to your person. And if you didn't know, well, shame on you. <laughs> Just kidding. Contend for the faith. Beloved, contend for the faith, says the Baptist Church. Grace, Baptist. However, take out the Baptist. Just leave it at grace. Grace is how we make space for change to take place. Oh, oh, oh rhymes is how we triumph in these trying times. There was a bike with triumph. I didn't even know that was a brand, but now you know. Did you know that corporations are pirates with different flags and ships called logos? Brands, banners, all of those, they just put on a different one if they don't get received well with the first, then they just change it because a pirate ship always carries a box of flags and a corpse can always re-identify itself as something other than it once was with a name that was defamed. Huh. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. I'm just playing a little drained and triumphing anyway. I say hey, 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 Laura J. Namaste for 